Hello, members. My name is Jeannie Ernst. Some of you may recognize me. I ran for provincial president in the last ONA board election in 2021. First, I'd like to thank those members who voted for me in 2021. Thank you. I'd like to thank my nominators for jumping at the opportunity to sign my nomination. I want to thank the people who supported me and stood up for me these past few years, especially those members in the Quinty Health Bargaining Unit. I am grateful for all who supported me. I hope you've read my candidate article. My platform continues to be advocacy for members and building a stronger union. Ona will be sending out emails to members, so please keep an eye out for them. In this video, I will be concentrating on Ona governance. I've talked to members from different locals expressing their views. The common complaints are workloads, short staffing, unsafe work environments, and not enough union presence. I believe this comes back to the bargaining unit representation. I believe more needs to be done in the bargaining units. I believe more members dues money needs to be directed back to the bargaining unit. A restructuring and an increase of transfer money back to the bargaining unit needs to happen to support the work of the union in the bargaining units. This advocates for members. This will increase owner's representation and presence in the bargaining units. I believe this will change workplace culture, keep employers accountable, and send a message to the government that we are a force to be reckoned with. I believe locals need to have more of a political voice in their communities. Ona has approximately 60 locals. We need more public action in the locals. Ona locals need to be more visible in their communities they serve. I believe Ona Central political action money needs to be redirected back to the locals. This will increase Ona's presence in our communities raising awareness about issues, facilitating public support, increasing our bargaining power. I believe Ona Central charitable donation budget should be directed back to the locals. Supporting local charities builds our presence in our communities. Locals and members should be deciding together where charitable donations should be directed. This builds union democracy and helps our communities. I believe we need more accountability with Ona, I believe the ONA constitution needs to reflect more of the members' will. There needs to be increased transparency of the work of ONA and work at rebuilding trust and sustainability in ONA. I believe ONA committees should be more representative of the membership. Expression of interest for ONA central committees should be addressed to all entitled members, making members aware of ONA central committee works. This allows the membership the opportunity to work for the membership. The choosing of committee members also should be a fair process. This builds membership participation, builds sustainability in ONA. I believe more ONA transparency about the works and financing of ONA Central and locals needs to occur. This will facilitate trust and membership participation. I believe members should have access to ONA policy. These actions will increase in transparency, accountability, increase membership knowledge, and direct the work of ONA. I believe members are ONA and need to feel empowered. My energies will be spent advocating ONA's vision and mission, not on pageantry, but the business of ONA. This is your union, your voice, your vote. Please vote. Thank you.